Burn Pigs and Bands. Oh! So, uh, yeah. Yeah, I went there when I was. Welcome back to City Heroes 2016. We're broadcasting to you from the Concordia building in Montreal. We're into picks and bands for the Tricksters versus ETSB Blue. I'm expecting some good matches here. We're back, us two. Finally back, yeah. Ellie, the dream team. Fire, thank you very much. Fire. We got that Udir band coming in and Elise from Purple Team. Wow, Ellie, you on fire, man. You know it, man. Jimmy. I am on fire. Once again, shout out to MSI for the sweet gear we'll be giving away a little bit. Some Mitch good swag. Shortly. Taking care of us. Thank you very much. I've seen the least, man. That's strange. By huh. ETSB. Guess they don't want to deal with that queen of the jungle, formerly. Not. I mean, she's still very versatile. Like, I, don't, I don't see why Udyr is permanently banned with the front thing. He just seems to want to deal with him. You don't but, want to deal with annoyances, you know, like especially Jax, in where you want consistent. Another Jax ban. Another? Uh, I don't remember Jax being banned so man? far. Okay. I'm just thinking of my solo key last night and saying, I wish Jax. Why is Jax banned? Oh, they got Soraka and Kogma. Oh, wonderful. Oh, great. This is going to be. Which is probably what's going to happen in this game because there hasn't been a Kogma ban yet in three. Oh, no, two, we've had a Kogma ban. One. Alistar, good. Alistar ban. That perma I mean, Malphite ulting. There hasn't been an Alistar yet today, has there? No, but it's been banned before, but I haven't seen one on stream. Oh. It's too bad, I want to see some messed up combos, even though you can't yeah. mess it up anymore. Kogma banned, there, there you go. go, 100% so far. No, we won't see any of this Pick nonsense ban. this game, finally. No walking turrets around here, thank no you very much. Turrets, no walking turrets, no garbage. <laughs> I am Summit, Onwards, Shari, Jiyoung, and Fisky, Trickster. Looking for the first pick, what do you think it's going to be? Huh, I'm, I'm not sure. I'm expecting a... Hmm. What could they first pick? Maybe some Gangplank? I'm not sure what the, the carry Italy? on this team is. In Italy? Italy jungle? Malphite. Oh yeah, Malphite was left open. Malphite? Oh, I guess they want to go for that safe pick. For first pick, Malphite. Yeah, Malphite was left open, which is... First time we've seen Malphite left open today, actually, so looking forward to see how it plays out in team fights. I, I love seeing Malphite with Oriana. You know, you get that ball wave, shockwave, unstoppable shockwave. There you go. I'm going to call it that. Unstoppable wave. Unstoppable shockwave. Unstop <laughs> I'm dying, guys. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Dimi, you'll get better soon. Don't worry. No. Until then, we appreciate no, I'm your just effort. dying. Just dying. Goodbye. This is the last turn. This is the like second in the last tournament I cast. Hmm. So, uh, Trash first picked in the first rotation. You want to get that uh, good, consistent support, utility, doing this good Gragas. stuff. Gragas. I haven't seen Gragas. I've seen a bit of Gragas this patch, but not yet. He got jungle. buffed recently too. I love the W, Brom. the AOE W now. Prom's a lot safer. Eh. I'm not. Prom's like. Not sold on Brom? No, I'm sold. But he just like stops everything. Like the big wall. He just puts the wall in. It's like, no, nothing's wow. gonna happen. Nar insta lock. That's different. We haven't seen Nar yet today. And I haven't seen Nar in a long time. I, I wouldn't have expected Nar to get locked in, honestly. No, I, I didn't expect to see any Nar this turn. I haven't seen any NAR in Korea. I haven't seen any NAR in NA. Yeah, no, no competitive game like, has been playing very NAR. I've seen so much Nautilus. We've only seen... Actually, one game was played by Concordia on Nautilus, and it wasn't even streamed. So... And Whiskey hovering that Zed. Zed was left open, and we saw last game... He uh, wasn't much of a factor in that last game, this Yeah, Zed. he was kind of... Kind of... And there's that Nidalee we talked about before. Nidalee. Yeah. There you go, they're considering that Nidalee. You were right about that. Nidalee is, Nidalee is actually one of my favorite champions playing. I spend a lot of time watching Rush for some other assignments by I mean, pro teams I won't talk about. Rush has got some But amazing. I had to watch like four hours of Rush Nidalee VODs and I have become, I have become the Rush. Okay. The we, C9 Rush. But we won't see Nidalee, unfortunately. We'll see Gragas. Ah, yeah, that's good stuff. Tricksters actually have set up a pretty weird comp. 
it's a lot of mixed damage, but it's just the fighting is just so strange. Like I see Malphite going in, and then Greg is holding them back out, and then Zed picking off target. Yeah, I guess just want to pick some people off and disengage. They don't want to fight everything. And then we go with the Amumu jungle again. So. Then you've got yeah, the Amumu's been very popular today, huh? That's the second time we see Amumu. Second, been banned as I well. I haven't seen Amumu since like. A year? <laughs> I've, I've seen like one Amumu, this is ZZ Legendary playing like AP Amumu mid in my, Amumu in my rank games. I was like, no, come on man. Don't Please. Do this to Not this again. Yeah, so uh, Lux actually had a ring the heal cleanse. Won't see that, hopefully. He'll cleanse, no, please. <laughs> I, I mean, cleanse is fine, but there's not that much CC to cleanse off. The only CC you could probably cleanse off is like, Brahms? Stun? Yeah. I think he's trolling. Yeah. Come on, RD. Show something better. Or will he be trolling? I hope. Maybe, maybe, maybe he's not level 10? Or 8, actually. 8 yeah, gives you flash. He has to be. <laughs> I he have has to, to be hope trolling. so. And... Not trolling. <laughs> okay, there you okay, go. There you go. <laughs> he, he changed it last second. That, that, that was cutting it close. That was cutting it close. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. Gragas, Jungle, Malphite, Corky ADC, Braum and Zed, solid composition versus a Mumu. Mumu Jungle, Thresh Support, Lucian, Nar, and a Lux. So we'll be moving into a bit of a delay now. So uh, we gotta get to get that spectator delay out of the way. So uh, we'll be back in uh, two minutes and a half. Uh, don't go anywhere. Hashtag TRK win if you want Tricksters to win. And hashtag ETE. ETS B if you want ETS Blue to win. See you in a bit.
immediately. <laughs> right away. I love these insta pauses. <laughs> Wonder what happened. Not sure. Well, Maybe you guys are having some issues. Here, let's set this up a bit. I hit. That's the wrong button. What did you press? Oh, it looks. It looks great. Oh no, there's no overlay. Put those. Uh, put those names. <laughs> there's up our there. logos. There you go. Gotta make sure now the people cool. that take care of us, we take care of them. Lightnar. Honestly, Lightnar is scary. Especially with Thunderlords. I didn't just, I didn't see if he was running Thunderlords, but like... Swords Blade, Nar, and Thunderlords is so annoying. Ah, uh, no way to see it from here. Nope. Sadly. Riot hasn't uh, fixed their Spectator client yet. And we can just, see it from the... I really like this Lux jungle. It's gonna be very interesting. Oh, <laughs> you're right. I love Lux jungle. You I have the worst the clear time. ever, but whatever. Does she have a bad clear? I mean, she's kiting them around, but... Uh... I think it's not as hard as you think it'd be, with, like, the E and auto. Yeah? Like, extra damage on your passive, that's right. But then I think it would really suck, because you just, like, walk into lane, miss your binding, and then just... Then you're just, you're just useless. Like, but, I mean, you're like... basically the least. You throw that cocoon, you miss it. Oh, well, okay, yeah, we'll just you're, walk you're, away. You're crap, you're at least. I mean, how fast is the dark... I don't know how fast the, these missile speeds are. I think... At least... I think at least cocoon is a lot faster than Lux. I mean, if I don't have the stats, I couldn't say anything. So I'm not going to comment on that. We'll say, we'll, we'll say it's subjectively faster. It looks fast. So adding to the already long delay, we have an even longer delay. Hey, these guys, they, they, like they want to make sure they're playing right. Pile them on now so we don't have to deal with them later. We'll have to deal with them later, very likely. Gotta love these issues, eh? Sorry about that, guys. And uh... You know what's amazing? We've got a player with a KDA of 40. This guy only died once. He's not playing now. Can though. you guess like what the uh, what role he's playing? Maybe support. Cause no, I don't think it's support. No, no, it's not support, no. <laughs> it's actually support. Yeah. Wow, I never would have guessed. Hey, I'm pretty good at not talking fast. <laughs> I never would have guessed it's a support after you told me it was a support. He's actually from the oh ETS God. team. Not this one though. No, not this one. The, the, the other, they're sister teams. This is ETS is actually sort of B team. They call them ETS Blue. ETS Blue, and we got ETS Amber as the other team. And, uh, and we're back into the game. There we go. They read it up. They agreed together, and we're gonna get some starts. Ping, ping, ping. Hear those pings go down already. Red side, yeah. But ETS is just pinging some various points on the red side, on the red side jungle. I always like oh. Luchador Blom Brom. Luchador Brom, yeah, with his chair. The best is his recall. He recalls and he's just gonna jump his on that poor is so funny because he just like shoots a chair at your face. It's not nice to shoot chairs. I do it all the time. You shouldn't do that, Demi. <laughs> We're gonna get a line of skirmish from ETS. They don't wanna go too hard on an invade. Uh, yeah, we haven't seen any crazy invades yet today, no, so... it's too bad. I wanna be- I want them- I wanna see them like go at each other. Yep. Force something, guys. Come on, be proactive. I remember the first CSL game of the year for Concordia. I was casting it, and they tried to invade and got quadra killed by Vayne level 1. Oh, dear lord. So Vayne started off level 2 with, like, Bilgewater Cutlass. I mean, <laughs> it gave you, like, what? And she, like, ended the game with 20 kills or something like this. Well, I mean, the first four were in the first minute, so it doesn't mean much. And she came back with a bilge water. <laughs> it's hard to lose lane when you got a bilge water, half an item over on your end of opponent. Yeah, that was uh, dark times. Dark times. Dark times in the Concordia esports uh, universe. Oh well, now you're doing better now. Got right. Oh god, what is going on? <laughs> hey, this is the first time we're seeing a leash from the bot line for yeah, the jungler. We're actually seeing a different start this time, which uh, it's going to delay the bot lane's power spike level two, which I don't. I don't really like. I really think Ragga should start topside and give Braum and Corky that level too. So they Work his way in. down instead. Yeah. So it's uh, they're just decreasing their lane, but I don't think they expect to go to him on a Thresh Lucian lane. Oh, that's great. No minions were lost in that while they were leashing. Yep. So they have access to all of them. And with those Targons, we're going to get some... Hopefully uh, Thresh can get some... Oh, wait, they're going to trade a little bit in top lane. Alpha getting the best out of that one. That's the... Uh, Thunderlord's Malphite versus uh, Grassini and Dying Nar, which is the opposite of what I thought it would be. I You'd expect it the other way around? Yeah, I, th I thought it was going to be like Thunderlord's Nar because you could get the triple proc yeah. from your auto attack and then the Thunderlord's comes down. And then Malphite would take Grassini and Dying just to survive a lane versus Nar, but it went completely backwards. 
I'm like thoroughly confused, but. Well, I mean, this work, it seems to be working out. These guys have to hopefully know what they're doing. <laughs> Nars is going to hit some minions. Smack We're going to go back to bot lane where they're skirmishing it up. Just gonna, oh, Zed goes go. in, gets binded. Gragas flashes with oh, the E, misses oh, it sadly. Lux has to flash still. He gets the summoner trade. So that, that was interesting. Gragas like tried to extend his body slime with the flash. Where just Lux stepped out of range by like a little just bit. Just sidestepped a tiny bit. Oh, wow, Whiskey going in hard on ArcD. He ignites him, flashes, gets the first blood. First blood for Zed. Malphite gonna go in onto Nar. Nar just jumps away. It would have been a lot cleaner mid lane if he had landed those shurikens. It would have Very. looked like. A... Hey, you can't you can't go wrong. You still got first blood. Can't complain too much. There, there we go. Like, Brom's passage is so strong, stacking up those uh, concussive blows. Concussive blows. Getting those, getting that stun. Then you get Quirky to just throw his phosphorus bomb. Some free damage right there. Concussive blows sounds so much cooler when he's in his Luchador skin than in his ice, regular ice skin. Oh, I mean, yeah, like, because he's a luchador. He just kind of hit the guy. The other guy, Brahms, real, like, official skin, just seems like a big teddy bear. The guy that you just want to Want to see my concussive blows with my chair? <laughs> and a concussive blow your face. Wait, no, no, no. Let's no, not do no. things to faces with, with the word blow. No. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I've said this now. Zed backed off and got a second long sword and his uh, null magic mantle. Wants to get some defensive. That's actually Lux went in for some for boots him. instead. Wants to keep dodging, walking away from these uh, shriekens. Yet she still gets hit. Yeah, getting rushing that hex drinker in a against an AP matchup. Oh, poor Naris. His CSing has been yeah. very poor. Naris having a bad day. The thing is with Nar versus Malphite. Malphite just walks up to you and presses E, and then your auto your Ooh. auto attacks get slowed. So RD getting bullied by go watch that whiskey. Mid lane. Gonna be a gank onto the mid lane well. Get spotted. Hiam summits on the other side, but there was a ward. He's gonna go clear that instead. Mr. Mr. Rob. Rob coming in to back <laughs> up uh, Arc D. Gonna show him some love. Hell no, don't worry, you got a jungler too. I'm not leaving you on your own right here. And then leaves him on his own. And then he leaves him <laughs> on his own to go get Raptors. Gragas coming in to from the top side from the tri bush. Malphite oh. showing his presence, telling him, no, you ain't going nowhere. You're gonna keep fighting him. Hits him with the the oh. seismic shard with the flash E, and there you go, go down. Mega Nar went down to Gragas, and Malphite. Oh, that is the, that, is the key that was amazing. He predicted that flash. Yeah. He body slammed into where he was gonna flash. That was some good stuff. Yeah, that was really well played. Summit's showing that you know he can outthink his opponent too. Yeah. I'm looking really good on this Gragas early on, besides the miss flash heat early on, so... Hey, you missed one, but hey, that's okay. You, Made up for keep it. being proactive. Amumu gonna fight it out with Gragas. Gonna throw that barrel, keep him slow. They're just gonna... Freaking auto-client. Wow, Lux is so Ooh, low. low. Lux is very low. She better not stay there, because Whiskey is gonna capitalize on Zed this. Is gonna, Zed is 6 now, so if Lux stays around any longer, she's gonna... Whiskey so, showing his presence. He's telling her, "Yeah, you want it back. Don't stay oh, close I to me." Amumu doesn't have much mana. Can't do much. Whiskey ain't afraid of you guys. Wow. Nar went down to Gragas what? again. Oh dear. All right. I mean, if, if you're telling he doesn't have flash, well, he capitalized. Yeah, obviously, he did not. Have, he didn't have flash, and Gragas' CC is just so much early on. They just waited for a Malphite to get his ult, and they went at yep. him. They one shot him. The Malphite has no ult. My bad. Don't worry about it. That was the client. We're on directed camera. Not good enough to <laughs> control the camera and talk at the same time. Just, it's hard. There's just so many games today that I feel like if I start controlling the camera, I'm just going to get obsessed and then get super tired. It's it's quite the work. ETS Kara? Sarah? How do you pronounce that Kara. name? Kara. Kara? Yeah. Okay. I don't know. Some people pronounce it Sarah. Not sure why. But hey, you do what people. There's a special kind of people that pronounce C as S. I mean, if they, it's, it's their name, so you leave them alone. You like, can't complain. When with I that. go to Coco Bun, I, I buy from Coco Bun and not yeah. So So Bun. Not So So, that's true. Ooh, oh, gets the hook onto Whiskey. Not, not gonna capitalize on it. He gets ulted. Whiskey flashes in the back, gets binded. Still gonna get some damage in, but he has to fly, He has to shadow out of there. 
RD oh, gonna come back in, gets body slam. Don't take the lantern, oh. miss the lantern. Get gets explosive barrel back. Denying him the lantern with the explosive cast. That RD really went greedy on that one that and really he well got played. punished. Yeah, Summit's been showing his, showing Gragas that you know, Gragas prowess, his Batman prowess, showing that he knows what he's doing on this champ. Batman God. He must have been extremely happy when that got buffed. Is the buffs are pretty substantial actually. His AP Gragas is super annoying to play against. Oh I, yeah. I don't know if he's played against it yet, but like, not in this season. I used to play it wow, against it in damage. season three. God. That was a pain back then. He's but maxing Q too, which is. Usually I prefer E Max versus range champions because he just really messed them up. But mm -hmm. like the Q Max just hurts so much. He wants to he wants to bully this Nar. He wants to push him out of lane, tell him no, this is my lane, and he's doing that. He's almost 30 CS up on him in melee versus ranged. Yeah, Malphite is crushing this thing right now. And he just goes in, ults him. The there you go, auto attack. You slap him on the head. Amu misses the bandage toss. He's gonna pull the curse of the sad Mumi. No, he's got that percent damage, and he doesn't have mana to get out of there. Whoa. He had to flash out. All right, then. Will Mumu keep chasing? No, he's not going to keep chasing that. He's just going to leave him alone. Take that summoner's spell. We got Tresh coming back bot lane. Gets queued. Hit by a chair. Hit to by the, the chair. To the face. No more faces. Shrimp Gragas going on Arc D. Arc D has his flash. Flashes out of there. A Mumu has to walk. You don't, you don't have enough damage to get out. Go, Exhaust goes on to lane. Dilution. Shiori going in, going in, very greedy. Wants to fight that. Flashes in, doesn't get the kill. They're going to go in on, on oh. Sarah. Pops the ult. They walk out of there. They don't get anything out of this. Don't stay too long. Oh, he gets the hook onto Shiori. Has to pop the, fla the, the heal. Gets killed. So low. Bomb goes in, gets the trade. Going to keep hitting it. Sarah. Does he have the damage? Oh. There you go. Not good enough. <laughs> Does he have the... Can he hook him in? No, too Supportal far away. Don't combat. fight him. Supportal combat. Go, Just go. get some minions. Wait for your actual carries to come back. And these supports. Playing for their team took exhaust. I wish they took ignite. I want to see some bloodthirstiness. Some bloodthirstiness. No, I want that kill. As a support, I go ignite and I just take the kill. I was playing with a friend of mine. I played Alistar. Yeah. And... I had three kills and he had zero on Draven, so... Support I, Draven's amazing. Support Draven is... He'll, get, he'll earn his kill one day and he'll get his stacks. <laughs> I, have have, earn I earned these kills. kills. I earned all the kills with my Ignites. He did not kill them. I got them. Don't, why are you using heal? Just use Ignite. Get those kills. Oh, Gragas comes go. in from the back, throws in the explosive oh barrel. God, RD gets it. thrown towards the middle of the lane. Whiskey goes in, gets that la that lasted on uh, oh my God, Lux. The damage already with the serrated Dirk and Mama uh, Hex Drinker just so much early on. It's amazing. It's just this poor Lux just getting bullied in lane. Lux doesn't have any armor either, so it's even harder on her right now. Oof! And being down literally double CS, Whiskey. Double CS, two four kills. It's crazy. Oh, oh, he gets hooked in under. Will he take back the? Ends up dead marking. But that's not good enough, he's just gonna die. Gets, oh, got exhausted along the way. Shiori goes on to Lucian with the help of Malphite TP. They didn't even have to ult for that. Malphite didn't even have to ult for that one. They just, they didn't even, none of them ulted. Ridiculous. He just walks in, slaps him in the face. There you go, that's what you gotta do. Throws a rock at him and then gank's done. The gank's done. I'm gonna win the jungle. Braum, you're gonna hit Braum a little bit. Shiori coming in from the right side. Has to... Oh, Valkyrie over the dangerous. wall. Very dangerous. Nar TP'd in. He's gonna get his rage soon. Gets oh, bro, Braum gets denies, him. denies them out. Oh, he has to pop the the, the ult. He's in Mega Nar, but nothing's happening. That he used his flash too. Really so. well played by Nar. Oh, are they gonna get onwards? Oh, ult! Four oh, man oh, ult! Goes down. Lux is dead. Shiori gonna keep hitting. Goes down to Mega Nar. Mega Nar going crazy. Get the Amumu, stack. and there you go. You're gonna give that kill Smack. to Gryas. Here comes the culling. Prom went down. Has to go dash away. Takes the lantern out. That was a the drive by culling. That was a two for two. That was an all out fight. Everybody was down there. Oh, Twisky go. gonna go in. <laughs> not true. Not trash. You're not in the right spot. This reminds me of the Concordia game we saw earlier, where there just kills every minute. There was seven kills by like minutes four or five. Yeah, and here we have seventeen kills in twelve minutes. That's not so bad. 
that is just gonna hang around this bush. Oh, there you go. Zed's like, no, no, no. Oh. I'm gonna stay in this bush until you die, and he gets him. Stainer goes down. That was dirty. That was very dirty. Dirty bush camper. He even ignited him. He didn't want to let that kill go. Dirty bush camper. <laughs> dirty bush camper. He's like Garen, but worse. Garen you never know when there's a Garen in those bushes, man. You gotta be careful. My favorite was like playing the Doom Bots. The Doom Bots, that was ridiculous. And then like you'd walk into a bush and there'd just be like a ghost Garen. Which was like the first time I saw him like, what in the heck? In that mode this. And oh she throws in the final scar, not good enough. Summit secures that with the sm Wait, did he have smite? Yeah he did. He did, there you go. Summit smite on point. Onwards, come on, get that pink ward. There Summit you go. with the sweet smite. Summit's been playing very well. He might be some CS down, but who cares? He's 303. You don't need CS when you're farming champions. The old M5 uh, strategy. Oh, C champion, kill champion. That's how it works, man. Don't need minions. Kill heroes. Amumu gonna stay on the side. Come on, Sarah, throw in that lan that lantern. Go back. Bomb. Throws the lantern. Mumu, you gonna hit that bandit sauce? He has the curse of the sad mummy. He so could do hard something. To engage on this bot lane. Very mobile with that Valkyrie and just Braum jumping in right after, stand Dragon's beside me. Back. Brag is gonna stay in that bot side, but there was a ward in there, so they know he's there. They're not gonna overstand on this. He's gonna dance away. I love that skin. It's just like having so much fun. Oktoberfest. I think uh, it goes on sale later this month, and I'm tempted to buy it. Hey. But I already have like three Gragas skins, and I never play Gragas. You never have too many skins. You can. Well, no, no, no. Not according to Riot. I'm, I'm with the problem with Ari, where I have all Ari skins, but I like default Ari the most. Yeah. So I was like. Do I use skins, or do I like be the? You go with the, the one where you're most hip, comfortable with. The hipster that likes all the default skins. Default skins are amazing. Start to really like default Lulu over every single skin too. No, no, no. For Lulu, you have to play the pool party Lulu. No, it's awful. Come on, you, that little it's squid so on her head. Annoying. Onwards, taking advantage of the fact that Shio Gold doesn't <laughs> have his passive, <laughs> just gonna ult him in, and there you go. That's it. He's solo killed. Zed, why are you here? Arc D, gonna get soloed by Hamsum, it has to pop the exhaust on him, gets the body slam, there you go, just hit him in the face with the More barrel. Fighting. Pops the calling, Ji Young, are you gonna go down? He gets healed, Shiori taking care of support, flash hook onto Shiori. Kill this. Not enough, gonna, Ji Young gonna go down, Lucian gonna get that hit, Skunkus of Blow saves that game for Shiori. Gets the stun on him, and if you're stunned, you're not doing any damage. Yeah, so this concussive blow just really turning things around in that bot lane fight. It's a CC is always a game turner, always it's just, just useful. That, that is why people love Braum this patch. It's just the concussive blows are just so strong. I think I like Alistar. I, I think right you like now. you like Al I think it's more of a. I'm looking forward to seeing him play. Actually, we haven't uh, seen him once. Alistar was banned this game, so yeah, sadly. It could be one of the things like. I mean, he does have one of the highest win rate at the moment in Korea, in the Korean solo queue. So yeah. with like 26,000 games played or something? Yeah. It's ridiculous. Alistar is everyone's go-to pick. Like, there's no real point in banning him unless you know the other team only prioritizes Alistar. Yeah. But like, a good Alistar is really good. It's just, just the presence it brings to games is scary. Oh, comes in with the package onto Arc D, takes the lantern. Is he gonna make it out? Flays him towards the tower. Arc D makes, oh. dies down. Nora coming in, he's got his passive. Is he gonna turn up? Just no, they had to this they're not they're only two against literally the whole team. Lucian's ball lane, he's pushing that lane. Amumu's back in base. Yeah, they'll be content. RD with just time. died. They just take mid tower for free. And actually and a kill. Rift Herald right now, but I think they have better. I think they're ideas. just gonna keep hitting this. Well, they do have Corky, and Corky if just they wait, try for us. So. Plus they can just wait out the Nar. Gets a hook onto Malphite, not the person you wanna hit. Comes in, oh Summit God. comes in with the body slam. Last minute, Narult puts him into the wall. Not good enough. They're just gonna take that tower and take it. Second tower for free. No one going down. Two kills and two towers, and they didn't have to trade anything on their side, except a couple cooldowns. Tricksters are doing good. Ultimate right onto Lucian. He did not expect that. Zed flashing and puts the deck mark onto Arc D. Arc D went, goes down. Sarah, Claude on the side, he's in the Run red side. Away. Summit's gonna get that body slam. Run no, away. doesn't. Gets the barrel, and there you go. <laughs> this is the weirdest animation. He got like flay smacked in the face. <laughs> this is gonna go back bot lane, get that in here tower. Amumu, 
gets the minion, puts the cursor this time, mummy. Maybe you get some damage on onwards. He doesn't go down. He's tanky enough. At least he got he got the disengage. They're not gonna give up that in hit tower for free. Let's see how much gold did they leave with that? Ah, uh, nearly 1k on everybody. Hey, they've got quite some gold and a free tower top minions. Or should I say, Winnians just got that. Thank you very much, Minions. They're the sixth player of the team. They are a good, good minion wave management will win you games. Like, they literally it's been, will. It's been the case in a lot of uh, the competitive matches. Competitive games recently where just smart minion wave management will just win you games flat out. There was they actually a game a couple of days ago. And it's time, you're gonna go in onto Summit. You can't just hit that tire for free. I'm gonna hit you back. There's actually a game like two days ago in Korea where DJ Antis and I think, I think it was Africa. Yeah, Africa. Or Samsung. One of those two teams where they're just a standoff and Sam. Uh, Amumu takes away the blue from his mid laner. <laughs> but mid is 0 8 at this point, so. I mean, come on, show some faith. You're on a team together. Show him that you know. I, I feel believe like he in you. He could carry more with this Cinder Hulk Amumu and. Haunting guys? Haunting guys that might be going. Frozen Fist next. Haunting guys into Frozen Fist. Gonna ban this toss onto Brom. Brom pulls up the shield. Does he get the hook? Ji Young go down. Puts the mastery emote. Gonna BM them a bit. Ji Young showing them what's up. Gonna get a free pink ward. Onward's gonna hit that tower with Shiori. Gonna get the bot tower. And Ji Young just showing that mastery of Brom. Young loves his BM. He's a master of BM. Oh, I'm gonna ban this toss onto the wolf with Zed around. Nothing gonna come out of it. Just gonna keep hitting that to bot tower. Pulls the culling. Unstoppable force onto the Stanner. Stanner goes down to Shiori. We got... Gets hooked. Final spark thrown in. Lux, Lux gets the Malphite. Amumu goes down to Zed. Summit. Zed's on the side. Is he gonna go in for that ArcD? ArcD goes down to Summit. We got Tresh going down to Shiori. And they're just gonna keep hitting Nar. Get that tower next. Push through. My, they just aced him. That's another really quick game. And Rift Herald's gone. The Rift Herald is dead. 28 to 6. I don't know why he's called the Rift Herald. He doesn't really herald anything. I, that's right, huh? He just stands there. It's a little scuttler just, like, that, that mutated. He Baron's like, house. House? Until he comes. Like, well, that's why he kicks him out. You know, this is my water. house. Gonna get the inhibitor <laughs> bot Rift man. Homeless Man. Rift Homeless Man. Poor guy, leave him well, alone. Those are junglers. Junglers are like the homeless people that go around to like their, their lanes. But maybe. they're very nice. They're helping out everybody. Unless they take your blue. Well, I mean, yeah. They don't believe in you. <laughs> That's too bad. They don't believe in us. Don't. I mean, some junglers don't believe in anybody. That's night blue. He takes every single buff. Every single. That's right. The carry style. The Meteo style. They're going to try and get him next to the Baron. Like Meteos is Use that vision against them. <laughs> oh, shots fired. Okay, I played against Night Blue and on the PBE. On the PBE. He was playing Azir Jungle. He kind of sucked. I mean, <laughs> Azir Jungle isn't exactly amazing. <laughs> Whiskey gonna come in from the flank. Gets binded. Gets Final Spark. Still not going down. Hex Drinker helping out. Lux gets him anyway. Shut down onto Whiskey from Lux. They're gonna keep pursuing them. They wanna get. They wanna get a little more. Sarah going in hard. She's like, no, 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 no. no. I'm gonna go get this. Kill Malphite, though. Have any Gets the hook onto J Young. Not much follow up, just Nar throwing some boomerangs on there. Like throws the calling. Unstoppable force. Arg D gonna get shielded, not going down right away. Summit ends up getting that. And Stanner gonna get hit by Summit. Sly Ghoul nice just hook. getting on the side with Shiori and J Young just on him. And he goes down to Shiori. Kara, Kara in the mid oh. gets flash auto attack. <laughs> Summit trying to outplay that bandage toss. Gets bandage toss and goes down. <laughs> That was some nice uh, foot play right there. Shiori going hard. He wants this. He wants standard. And he gets him. Gargus was just too fat to dodge the bandage toss. Oh, yeah. That's, he's a big boy, man. Can't dodge everything when you're that big. They're going to try and end this. Mr. Rob coming in. Doesn't have the ult. Just going to keep trying to get some delay on them. Doesn't want to lose this right away. Lux coming in with yet. the home guards. She's got everything. Throws it up, throws that loose and singularity, throws the bind, gets it in. Oh. Final spark, onwards goes down to Arc D. Mr. Rob, gonna keep pushing them. Finalis. Finalis Fumkin, that's right. <laughs> I have to stay for all these spark, else people get lost. Shell Ghoul, gonna teleport in, gonna get some autos onto G Young. Jumps on him, the gets jump. healed from Shiori. They're gonna 2v1 oh. him, gets stunned. 
Jiyoung goes down onto the side to the whole team. Shiri has to walk away. RD oh. dies to the death mark from. Actually got hit by Damn, the, whiskey. The dusk card down the, the, the blade. The dusk blade of Draktar. Dusk blade. Draktar. Yeah. Come on, man. Don't you play some like? No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Just gonna shadow out of there. Play racing games. Play racing. Has to flash away from the hook. The Mercedes. The Mercedes. <laughs> I don't think there's a Benz in here. <laughs> Like, he just saw the dust blade proc, and then right after, the poor Lux just sees like the death mark appear above her, and she's like, oh, well, okay. I'm dead now. I'm screwed. And she's like, oh, I'm okay, and then the one pop, and then the second is like, ah. Uh, Amumu taking his red buff away from this Lucian, doesn't trust in him. Whiskey bullying everybody, everybody's afraid of Whiskey. I feel like Mr. He's Rock just gonna throw that him. shadow in, oh. hit him. Oh. Gets bull gets ulted into the wall, stunned up. No you, you're a bit tanky. Doesn't get the bandage toss. Doesn't go down. Gets ignited. Gets Morello actually. Goes down to Mr. Rob. <laughs> Mr. Rob wants to carry this. He's putting this on his back. 4 2 2. Not exactly the best score, but he's doing his best. Sadly, oh, packages <laughs> for so that blue the buff. Hey, you know, you gotta get what you gotta get. Actually, I don't know Give it to Malphite. I don't know why Malphite got that blow. I feel like Corky with blue buff is a lot more dangerous than Malphite is. I mean, more unstoppable forces and it is Not really. quite the good. I don't know. Yor has his, his, uh, his frozen fist, so he doesn't really need the CDR. More cooldown. It would have been so much better on Corky. I mean, cooldown is always a good stat. Except when you reach the cap. It's me being, like, really... Hardcore analyzing it, but it's a lot better on Corgi. Just, just so the siege damage, just the poke, just a lot better on Corgi overall. I mean, I at this point, I don't think they're too, too afraid. It doesn't really matter. At no, this exactly. Point. <laughs> when you're like 11k up and 22 kills, it's yeah. not, you're not too worried. But I mean, you can still throw this. These guys get too complacent. Forget it. Maybe we get a dignitas at Baron. Hopefully not. Smelling the pizza behind us. Oh like, yeah. Hungry. Let's not. Let's not get distracted too much. Mr. I'm gonna clear some words with that Raptor buff. Trickster is gonna get that top tower altogether. I've actually had that minion bug in my game where the minion just walks into the turret. It gets stuck there. It's the weirdest. He just stays there even if the turret dies. Ooh, gets the body slam onto RD. Oh. He just melted away. All that CC just yeah. jumping they, they in on him. He's not tank. He's... Ji Young blocking everything oh, with that shield. Unstoppable force onto Stanner. Body slam. They're using everything onto Lucian. Poor guy going down, Mr. Rob, you going down, even under that tower. Trash, flays oh, him away, wants to play with them, uh, wants to play with them, goes down to drag, to Whiskey. The turret tanking actually no one really died. impressive. Kind of upset, Malphite didn't tank any turret shots. But they yeah. all managed to juggle it properly and came out of that ahead. Very good guess. micro by the team. Shows that they're working well together. Now they could either go for the other end or they could go for There's the only end. one Nexus tower and there's yeah. only Gnar in the way. And Lux coming in, but... Uh, I don't think they're too, too afraid late. of Lux. They're just gonna keep hitting that tower unless they want to fountain die these guys. Oh, Nar going in, puts oh. the ult, gets oh, him no, onto the Nexus. Really well played, they ended it. Trickster wins this game over ETS Blue. GG Tricksters. Trickster's OP? Was that really? I mean, they didn't trick him very much. They just went at no, him and just straight, hit him. They just went straight up at their face. There's no tricks involved, just like 1v1s. Ah, it's too bad. I would love to see some tricky stuff. Yeah, that will do it for game one. Stay tuned. We have a bit of giveaway. We have some giveaways right now. In-house giveaways, yep. So, uh... Don't go too far, guys. We'll be right far. back. Yep.